Kazi Cole's comfort home. This is Mass Marauder right yeah. here. The crowd goes wild! No, are you serious? State of the art stone. The heck is this? I got no microwave yet. What's going on y'all? Welcome back to another video. Today I'm with my mom. Uh, she's a realtor. So we got a couple of houses that we're gonna look at today. Uh, kind of get like behind the scenes. doing virtual tours because uh, we had a drive far for this like this kind of stuff get me excited about like even my own house and all of that knowing what to look for and knowing what i like and all of that trying to learn some information early so i can set myself up uh, but i encourage y'all to do the same whenever you can welcome to kazi cole's comfort homes you know what i'm saying Everything is state-of-the-art, everything is high-quality, top-notch. Nice little light fixture right here. You know what I'm saying? State-of-the-art stove, oven. We ain't got no microwave yet, but don't worry about it. Got a state-of-the-art dishwasher. You know what I'm saying? We got running water, clean water. This is, this is still new construction, so it's not uh, fully finished just yet, but it's nice so far. House number three. Mom's down there on the phone with him. This is cool, man. Whoa, somebody has been in here. This house comes in with a uh, built in headboard. <laughs> Last house of the day. Seems like an Airbnb type house, bro. Do a 40 yard dash in here. It's a gunshot house. That's the front door. And it goes straight to the back door. It's a direct line. But this was, I ain't never seen one of these before. Oh, this type of lot. You got a little twist. Big old backyard. It's nice. You can tell they have pets. Why chew that up? Nah. Taking put trash out. An actual yeah. shopping How cart. Shopping cart. That's that's true. Because if they would declutter, I'm looking at it like that. Like, yeah. You, you cleaning out the house. So I'm looking at something like somebody got evicted. So that's what that is. Somebody got put out. When you see Ooh. stuff like that on the curb, so the other part of our business Isaac property preservation is we would be the company that goes in and cleans that out and gets it ready for like what we're showing now. That's a whole company that does that. Neighborhood is better than Thank you for a minute. Mm. Yeah. Thank you for a minute. Yes, yeah. What happened? No, the back. You got to cut off. Oh. There. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> That's insane. That's worse than the house in Rock City. Mm -hmm. That's a good three, three and a half, four feet right there. I ain't gonna lie. Looking at all these houses make uh, make you feel glad to be a homeowner. Like, I want. I look forward to it now. Yeah. And it make you want to like take pride in it for real. I think the saddest thing is when a family has to sell the home because grandma needs to move into a retirement community or the matriarch or patriarch in the family passed away yeah. and they didn't write it, they didn't will it out. In two miles, put it turn in right estate. onto South. Every starter house doesn't have to be base bottom, but what's important is to get what you can afford. Let the property accumulate value sell it and then buy your mid-level or your retirement home 
Once you get informed about what it takes to buy a property, you need to buy sooner than later. How does it make sense, bro? Sun is out. Now this is different. I still neighborhood. About as white though. One of the downsides of new construction is bugs. Yeah, this we near the area where uh, I went to middle school in my freshman year in high school. Like. Full circle moment. Oh, okay, so um, part of it is twofold. Right. You got to see the property, right? You got to see the property yourself. Um, but say, for example, if you don't go see the backyard and something is in the backyard and you didn't know that it was in the backyard, that's on you. Yeah. So you literally have to walk it in and pay attention, and, especially with the purchase. Oh, them things moving. Oh, you better know how to drive. It's too flat, right? Yeah. 12 laps? Yeah. Oh. That's one race here. Huh? Only one race? <laughs> Might as well. Yeah. On them grades. Yeah. Yo. Wow, that's a mass marauder right Yo. there. <laughs> oh, somebody. Fake. You shy, see that's my dog. Well, who you know I'm really shy. Yeah. You got an arcade in here? Oh boy, what? How you play this? You gotta get a car. You gotta get a car. Oh, okay, okay. We got massage chairs too. This is a cool little spot for a party, man. Nice. All right. Better than. Give me a massage. How much time do you think we got? We got five, uh, 15 minutes, 20 minutes, 30 minutes, 40. I ain't gonna lie, my back hurts, man. Eh? <laughs> oh, oh, the heck is this? Did it start already? Hey, something moved. I sat down. It was, I think it, it went from top to bottom. I think it was resetting. Yeah. I didn't know what that yeah. was. Did he get it? What helmet? What helmet? I head might be a little bit bigger. Oh! Three motorcycles. Three motorcycles. You think this is good for me? Huh? You think this is a good size? Yeah. Even with your hair, you'd be good. Mm. Yeah, motorcycles. Mm. Oh, okay, let me put this on. You got it in that car? Daddy been doing that stuff. Yeah. 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 Bro, that's because we started late. We started late. Uh, you didn't beat us, though. You didn't beat us. You got in front of me on the first lap. You got in front of me on the first lap. Go, on, man. <laughs> I didn't want to hit nobody. I wasn't going to hit nobody. I was going to go around here. <laughs> you want to go up there? I did 11 laps. I didn't even do 12. Because we started late. Oh, that's close. Because we started late. No, y'all got to 
Oh, uh, this is the spin outs, man. Okay. They, they messed up the flow. Mm -hmm. Too many people that don't know how to drive, that's what do it. What's up, Pete? 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 Chair is moving. Hey! Oh my! Where's my car? Oh! <laughs> oh! Shit. I'm not doing that. I'm not doing that. Hey! Oh! Oh! How come driving with the light on was so bad? Mm -hmm. When we was younger. <laughs> Turn that light off. <laughs> Maybe on the freeway, he'd be like, you gotta get, you're gonna get pulled over if you got the light off. Man, I seen the video, I said, it's not even illegal. Uh, I really thought it was. I think it was. At yeah. one point in time. Good mm. though. Little puff things. Mm -hmm. Well, we gotta find these in Dallas so we can get them at lunch. Man, it's $3.99. Pizza puffs. Them, um, Pizza puffs, no puffs diddy. At the other place. Ice cream and get socks. Don't you gotta get another one? You gotta get the beef. Just the regular beef. Look at your face. I said, which one do you want? I don't know. Let's take it out. I don't think the cookie dough was good. My man, it's really good. Yeah, the banana split is really good. Banana it's like split. a gelato. What's in there? It's um, it's a vanilla with strawberry and banana. Vanilla, strawberry. Okay. Oh, it's cold, cold. Yeah. It's gone. Oh yes, sir. I ain't got candy. Okay. 
I mean, I use it good. Who chose this cutting? We're not losing. Not a little pregame meal. Yeah. Damn. Camper basketball game. Let's go get it. Yeah. We're at the Mavericks. We're at the Mavericks. Practice facility. The Mavericks practice facility. Sponsored Mad Foundation. I got the new Nikes on, you know, the Panthers. Got a fun slide. Fun slide. I got on Jorts. We gonna make it work. We gonna make it work. In the comments, they gonna be like, yo, y'all still gonna have blisters in there. I ain't even got the right shoes on. Last day of camp. We here. I got y'all five. We're here. Ready? Woohoo! But who started five? Hey, I wish you Big offensively, a lot of momentum. Right. How you how you feeling? Right now I'm feeling a little tired. Uh, but we're gonna keep going through. Yeah. Uh, as long as we keep the D strong, right. I think we're gonna be alright. We just gotta keep the D strong and uh, just keep keep staying in shape. It's actually really sad. No, ref went Trey old, here. washed up men are beating up on adolescent children. You know what I do? They sign up. You know what I do? You know what I do? You know what I do? You know what I do. Keep the beast strong, shoot half court shots, oh. make it look good. Oh. Let the young guns oh. do their thing, you know. Let them kind of show up and then, you know, just get good, better in leadership. <laughs> Line work? Right. Go ahead, me, Jay. Y'all don't know easy on the Oh, yeah. Huh? At the end of the day, bro, we're pretty just out here hooping, balling, doing what we always do, you feel me? Uh, game four of the finals, we up 3-0 right now. Uh, against eight and nine year olds. Yeah, I think they'll, you know. Against 10 and 12 year olds. Today, our competition is good competition, you know. everything. Our competition. Against little boys and girls. Our competition is good competition. Look how hard he sweats. Look at the sweat on his face. He's grown kids right here. It's just because I drink a lot of water. Okay. All right, look, look, look. Look quick pregame. How much you putting up? 45. You putting up 45? Count. Yeah, that's 
Yup, yeah, took that cookie. What kind? Butter, scotch, and sugar. Corner. Oh, watch this. This shot. Oh. Ooh, that's two up there. Cause I don't, I don't like this. You ain't been, you ain't been making it, man. What's up? What's going on today, man? Yeah, I ain't gonna lie, this MVP right here, he got about 12 assists. That's what I'm saying. He got all them assists. About 15 on him. Oh, he got an end on the mate. Ooh, money with a bucket. Money with a 